हाथ में पेन भी नहीं है गुड इवनिंग लेडीज एंड जेंटलमैन एंड वेलकम टू दी अद्भुत आवर बट वेलकम टू दी अद्भुत आवर टूडे वी विल बी डिस्कसिंग वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट सब्जेक्ट फ्रॉम ऑल अराउंड द कंट्री एंड नॉट जस्ट अराउंड द कंट्री फ्रॉम द वर्ल्ड इट्स सेल्फ विथ अस इमिनेंट मतलब दे आर अबाउट टू दैट काइंड ऑफ इमिनेंट we've got the one and only cyrus sahukar a big round of applause we don't usually do that on news shows but here we'll allow it cyrus sahukar looking Thank fresh you. as a daisy i'm a daisy lovely and of course the man with the viscosity of viscousness and the consistency of consistent things mr suresh speak. menon that, 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 don't do not try to patronize me oh wow it's a quite a hostile environment um before the show has even begun good evening everyone especially the harami chat hold on check this out guys we can talk to each other one on one they'll have no idea yeah guys yeah yeah oh. to um anyway cyril kidhar hai some people say we're going to riot if cyril doesn't come so please carry on with your riot uh we'll send you his address okay <laughs> good he's join a friday night bro <laughs> yeah too many friday nights he has been enjoying yeah so um good evening everyone welcome to adbhut things episode 2 it's amazing that we have all most of us have made it back over here to discuss of course adbhut things uh, before we start the tonight's uh, panel bulletin slash discussion how have you guys been ghar pe sab theek we say all this also in a news tone How are you guys? घर पे सब ठीक. I've been one second. I've been okay. I've been okay. Oh, पानी वानी आ रहा है. Hey, that's nice to have discussion. I yeah, agree discussion, but everybody's talking. It's <laughs> morning at lunch. मेरी दादी माँ ने कहा था. I want to be like this all the time. <laughs> but food, what, what, heavy, heavy day? Was it a heavy day, guys? Easy day, heavy day. Heavy, yeah. heavy, very heavy, sir. <laughs> Suresh, full power day today, no? Yeah, it depends what you're talking about exactly. Yeah. Suresh is looking like it's been a long day, though he's fresh and ready, but he's he's yeah, hard yeah. day. What do you want, sir? Suresh, working hard like crazy. Yeah, man. Listen, how how's the? So you got a gig? You went to office today or what? I did, sir. I did, sir. It was a rather pleasurable experience, and you know, you need to work. People need to work. and the best part today was that i heard someone say that maybe masks are also going to go off very soon yeah oh really no, but maybe but you're, you're right you <laughs> need to work. already off you, you need to work, you need to work cuz otherwise you get this bombay guilt i think it's it's a bombay guilt bombay guilt no no it's no, not bombay some, guilt i want to trademark that disease two years of not Hilarious. working but you were working suresh that is true but not much anyway Thank you, you Sabha, for your message. You're not getting out of your bed and getting ready and going to a oh, location. That's that the fucking. That's the game changer, bro. Anyway, that's now that like. now that we finish with the pleasantries, tan 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 tan. Getting into oh, this chat, bro. Oh, sorry, sorry. Yeah. <laughs> do you <laughs> suffer from do you suffer from upcoming work anxiety, Lord <laughs> oh, Suresh? Oh yes, Hulia. I do. I do actually. I do. <laughs> yeah. Hey, we have Dr. Cyrus. We've talked about this a lot. I can't sleep the previous night and all when there's work in the. Oh no, no, like so. For example. to in it and the problem with it is anxiety visits you uninvited bloody hell it's yeah. not like main aa raha hu kal dopahar 2 se 4 ready rehna you like, never know garam chai ke sath baitha hu ab aa raha hai so it's like just i had a full power day like that man but brother hose i want to know about your day before you kick us out and start uh, your other conversations i'll pull you in and start the other conversations my day uh, started off very eventful i woke up early in the late evening and uh, you come back oh. to your uh, bad behavior no, no i'm kidding uh, it's kind of wavering here and there but ho raha theek sab theek hai once again i i woke up at 7:30 what are you thank you, you for sharing that fantastic i saw rocket boys last night till uh, very late and i must say it's a fab show man yeah. well made bro awesome awesome huh? Impressive. Clearly, the panelists think that this is about TV shows and stuff. They don't know. Yeah. So, uh, welcome back, everyone. To and then I've been. I would getting, recommend I've watching getting Popcal. An, dude, I met some guy. Uh, uh, I met some guy who just keep kept. What do you? I want to ask you guys a question. Supposing sure. you get a message on WhatsApp from a person who's very friendly, right? Okay. So they kind of know you, and you go look at their image, and you fucking can't remember them, right? <laughs> But you're not. So I'm getting nervous today. <laughs> For 25 minutes, this person is incessantly saying, "What's up, Sai? Sai? What's going on?" Been He's talking long. to you like he knows you also. Yeah, hey, it fully could be knows. Brocha. It could Bro, be Brocha. No, I saw the face. It was a guy smiling. He looked happy and all, but I have no memory of when. How, what is it? This thing? And he's like, "It's been too long. I'm calling you tomorrow. We must chat." And I have started getting worried. 
know what to do. <laughs> this is a truly adbhut. What a segue that was. And here we go, guys. Beginning the show with adbhut things. Um, Cyrus Sahu. I want to be that guy, man. I want to be the guy. I think everyone should try this once before they sleep. Where you yeah. pretend like you, you know other people. Message a person <laughs> like you're really good fucking friends, and just see their nervous reaction. Sing lunch tomorrow? Yes? Question mark? Huh? Grateful, <laughs> <laughs> okay. Here we go. It is yeah. time. Like guys, please put on your news stones. Uh, our panelists: Cyrus Saukar, Suresh mm-hmm. Menon, and of course uh, myself. I will be hosting today and trying to steer the conversation, and I will fail terribly. So let's begin with our first uh, first story. You're, you got a pillow behind you, and look like it just died of exhaustion. Look, <laughs> they, Suresh, look at the look at the <laughs> pillow. <laughs> he's, like, yeah, yeah. <laughs> he's in a, such an unhappy marriage. That pillow. Look at him. He stuffed his head under. I got the scared for a second. I was like, is he talking about yeah, me? Yeah, yeah. Like, anyway. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> so the first story is um, apparently okay, you're going back to story bro this I'm is sorry. Really un- no no we'll take breaks in between so yeah. um, the first story coming to you uh, live from our studios is that apparently a board security guard allegedly ruined 740000 pounds worth of a painting on his first day at work uh the painting was by anna laporoskia which d- depicts faceless figures was allegedly ruined after a board security guard drew on it during his very first day of work and uh, i'm right now going to give you those visuals of the before and after that apparently is what the painting looked like originally Where? and then he just drew oh, see, honestly, some honestly. eyes on it so you'll have to uh, check the stream <laughs> oh But yeah, I'm taking the stream. It's not yet coming. Yeah, yeah. Aiga, you're not. Uh, technology Aiga. is a little late and low quality. You should be a top notch. You have uh, completely. So yeah, anyway, so very interesting. Ah. Uh, so what did you do? This is quite nice stuff, man. Who yeah. is? Who, 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 it was like a minimalist <laughs> painting, and then what he just drew. Do? Oh, he just drew two idiots, eyes. <laughs> <laughs> I, I don't know. I'm not fully convinced by the story. Who in their right mind would do that at an art museum? But where did he get this information from? This is all over the internet. All the newspaper. You know, yeah, no, he yeah, must yeah. have done it. There are enough people. You know this shit. There are enough people whose childhood has instilled them with enough confidence <laughs> to do that this. They feel that they can go around being dicks, man. Of Bro, course. Oh, I would shit myself. A man, a man of money, you owed people because you drew on a painting. No. No, you you shit yourself see, because you've had, had enough in enough humiliation built into you, so you know that like this is not going to go well. This is going to be that. But maybe <laughs> maybe बिचारे ने सोचा रहेगा कि मैम साहब ने पूरा painting complete नहीं किया हम थोड़ा आँख बना ही देते हैं ना हाँ ये वही ये देखिए सुरेश जी ने ना आवाज में एक पूरे इंसान की attitude this is a guy from the UK by the way who is speaking oh, okay. but oh, Suresh ji देखिए कहीं ना कहीं पूरी आपकी पूरी ज़िंदगी मैं सोच रहा हूँ याद नहीं तीस से ऊपर की उम्र का होगा है ना बिल्कुल है ना तीस सालों में हम लोगों को तो एक तो एक ना एक दिन तो आपने कहा होगा ना मैं दीवार पे एक बर्ड बना ही देता हूँ अब <laughs> उसी दिन पे आप जलील हो गए या तो माँ ने थप्पड़ मार दिया या लोगों ने कहा तुम्हारे बाप की दीवार है कि तुम बना रहे हो तो तुम थोड़ा ए, हार्ट ब्रेक हो गया इस बंदे की लाइफ में हार्ट ब्रेक था ही नहीं इसको कभी किसी ने बोला ही नहीं की I think, <laughs> bro. I think this guy is like, yeah. I really think the intent was that he thought that Kal Subha everyone will watch this and say, "Wow, now she can see." You know? <laughs> no, somebody noticed it at a at an at one of those like uh, showings of the painting, and someone said, "Hey, wait, those eyes weren't there before." <laughs> He never no way! So oh. they're telling me no one noticed this no also for a few days. No one noticed it for a little while. Yeah, then they were like, "Oh, I got to feel this guy's like, I did it, I did it, I did it." <laughs> <laughs> Or maybe I also feel that Scary. he felt it was looking very disappropriate, and you know, maybe kids will come in the morning to the uh, gallery and they may like see something which they are not supposed to see. So he decided to draw eyes and make it more friendly. Which are ah, you should pay some attention to him. But can I just say something? Is he is he Indian? Who's the what is the origin of this guy? I don't, don't know. I honestly don't know. Let's find out. Then then you have not done your research because this is a perfect like Lalla boy. You this know, Lalla? is not that kind of Maka Lalla. Where she like Lalla, beta, kitta ki ud lag raha hai. Dekho, dekho, dekho. But if you look at both the pictures, now I have to say there's not much of a difference. Yeah, it does yeah, change yeah. the yeah. pictures in a certain and, way. And quite frankly, I have a lot to say about the laziness of the artist. Like, yeah, <laughs> you just lost interest, bro. Let's be honest. His uh, his version is a little has a little more character. Anyway, let's not get into all that. But yeah. that was our first story. Thank so you, Pandal. Did he get fired? Did he get he fired? He got fired. He got fired. And Obviously, now, got now, fired. Now imagine, he's a graffiti artist. Imagine if they said, "Arey koi nee, sirf uh, saath 
कितना सेवन हंड्रेड एंड फोर्टी थाउजेंड पाउंड चलेगा आइंदा मत करना कैन आई कैन आई यस बोलो सर मैंने मेरे जो न्यूज निकाला उसके बारे में बोलने बोलना अलाउड है Allowed, hai, sir. I don't have accompanying visuals, but you can definitely talk about. Well, yeah, thank God we don't have accompanying visuals. But this is what <laughs> uh, this is about. Uh, Gwyneth Paltrow. Oh, Frenzy. Yeah, friend, friend. And uh, oh, this this you know said to be. I know her. Uh, Gwen, <laughs> She doesn't. Gwen know and you. me go back a long back. Possible. Yeah, and uh, my colleague, <laughs> when uh, news reporter Ambrish reported <laughs> this to me immediately, and he said that, sir, I saw who I am. So basically, she made a candle. Which smells like her. Oh so, shit! I know this was a huge hit. Like this her sold out in a couple of hours. Yeah. Her, uh, uh, her vagina, her, her, bro. Yeah. yeah. But listen, I think you. He forgot the word. It's been how how long he, has it been, bro? He didn't want to not say it. He forgot. This guy no vagina. I don't know what it is. What is this? I don't know. I don't. I don't know. Get it away from me. I'm just trying to be slightly more. Uh, you know, Suresh, I think you misunderstood yeah. the the article though. It's just called. Smells like my vagina. I don't think it. I, I don't really think uh, you can recreate the smell of a vagine via a candle. I'm just saying. Yeah. And scientifically, you can. You can. You can. Tell us more. You can. I mean, why can't you? I mean, you don't. Really <laughs> Acha, you mean why can't you? Okay. Like Fair you can enough. recreate any possible <laughs> yeah. smell, right? Maybe one at a time, though. Yeah. I we will. Like, I just want to tell people we get get to the super chats in between. We'll take breaks uh, to read some of your super chats. Uh, right now, it's. Uh, Oh gosh! I just missed that. I took a picture. What's the difference the between a, 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 what's the difference between a chat and a super chat? So chat is just a regular chat. Super chat is when they attach some of their, um, what's it called, their capital, Ex- some of their cash. money, money. their money. Oh, so now then, big up. That's why you're treating so the chatters like with like less little right? disdain. Koi. Koi. <laughs> uh, Akshat Sharma says, uh, "Sumit Pandey, your number is not looking good. Call her." He's using this as like a radio station. Oh, wonderful. Anyway, so uh, that in case you want to buy those candles, they're called smells like my vagina or something. Like, can, so I, can I ask you a question? Can I ask you a legit, legit question? Please. Right? Yeah. That's what we're here for to intellectualize. How, I, I would buy. Bullshit How discussion. legit do you find? I find Gwyneth Paltrow so full of shit, bro. Oh. <laughs> oh. Everything <laughs> about that goop and the billions she's making and this organic, like the way she does it. I don't know, man. I don't think there's any real. research and development i honestly don't know her personally so i cannot make a comment but there are a lot of these articles about all this pseudo sort of like i'm not getting personal uh, like that way i'm not saying like for example if i want to get personal be like i don't like the way she looks at me because that has always made me uncomfortable fair at parties enough, fair i'm not saying that i'm saying <laughs> there's something about that brand man it's a bit like hey we will rub now this oil and all of me you know they are yeah, kind a of little... pe- trademark name you know what it's i mean a, yeah it's a little bit in that like, space of like i mean if you're buying yeah. one of her candles that supposedly smell like the vagine anyway and it's selling what... out Yeah, it's like selling out in a couple of hours type. And that's yeah. only Suresh's orders. <laughs> We haven't even reached the. Re- She hasn't started like the rest But of the you world. You know how when you know what kind of mental uh, illness you have to be at. So you've decided that they. I'm gonna make something that smells like my vagina, right? And I know that there'll be enough people who want it, who want to sit and buy it and pay good money to smell it. And then they're sell, smelling it, and think of the benefit you have, right? Nobody really is checking if it is smelling like a vagina. You'll be like, "Oh hey, no, man, lavender! This is lavender, bro." This, is, this discussion is going the wrong direction because I, I repeat, I want to get a sir. therapist in, bro. I want to get a therapist in. What also, kind of vain bastard? Tomorrow you I, call me and say, "I want you and uh, uh, Suresh to invest so, your millions." No, because, I, obviously, yeah, I something like that smells like my uh, dirty toe or smelly oh, foot sock. Balls. I want right. I'm like one. Yeah, I I I also feel it's a bit of a issue over there because supposing मेरे पास घर पे एक ही candle है और light चली गई हाँ और मैं candle जलाने के बाद मैं जस्ट सूंग रहा है कहाँ That's not uh, right. I was interrupted earlier when dogs. I was talking about this. I was saying <laughs> that the candle does not. I'm quite. I mean, I can't be sure, but I'm pretty sure that the candle does not smell like her. It's but just that's a, a complete name. lie to the goop to the audience yeah. to the to the people buying, bro. Jose, no, anyway, Jose will be able to give us all kinds of things. See, Jose will be able to clear, give us a clear answer tomorrow because his <laughs> shipment super pouch is. Imagine I put the whole pool oh, building. Like, it's like a foolproof <laughs> plan, right? If I tell you this smells like my uncle. Now you don't know my uncle, so I'll be like, yes, yeah, did. it could be anything. I'll be like, oh, your yeah. uncle smells nice, and you're like, ha ha, yeah. my uncle doesn't smell like that actually. Exactly. So <laughs> imagine all our male actors did that. Give, I shall curse it. So let me have my bum candle. Oh, I, I, I did not see this coming. Although I should have. Uh, you're talking about Indian celebrities <laughs> making similar candles. Yeah. Oh my God, that would be insane. 
I'm sure that'll sell out. Yeah. <laughs> Zephyr's bump candles. No, you stop. You guys ever feel like, man, like maybe I should have done some shit like that and sold out. <laughs> I swear, man. Yeah. Don't Suresh, need to work hard. Suresh, when you're doing 13 hour fucking trial. shifts, your eyes are hurting <laughs> and everyone's like, nee, thoda weak lag raha tha, toh us din thoda thakka hoa na, repetition wale karakter. Energy, character. energy, <laughs> energy kyu nahi hai? I'm like, uh, I'm the millionaire who like, you yeah. know, so this Ekot is my hair nose. Fake hair nose. Fake hair nose. Fake hair nose. Thank you, panelists, uh, for your wonderful insights into that. Especially uh, Cyrus for giving us such a personal uh, insight into what those scandals. What a psycho, bro! What a psycho chick to think like pretty that. Pretty weird, yeah, yeah. yeah, pretty weird. Hey okay. guys, welcome to my board meeting. Do you want to make a candle with us? Like, oh, China. They were like, yeah, 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 yeah. But it could have also. Sir, madam, in this, me, your original is not working. So, if you get some sample, then I will be ready. Yeah, no. I will be ready to do it. Just, uh, just to play uh, devil's advocate, it could have been a creative meeting where some, like you know, like new age guy was like, "Hey, you know, we'll grab everyone's attention. They'll talk about it on like semi-popular po- podcasts and stuff. So maybe they're winning. They are mm, winning, bro. They something to think about. Million dollars, while we three people out of three people on this panel, two have been given a mic by the others. Oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> so fucking, they are winning, and you are losing. Yeah. So Rish, you can do something with. Uh, this is not a bad word. It might sound like chutter. Yeah, you only had told us that it means uh, butt, uh, bum, butt, yeah, penis. It does, it does. You can it do some, be. make some kind of product like that around that. Anyway, let's not get into all that. There are two third candle. Yeah, I don't like when <laughs> Paltrow, but I'm done with her. Yeah. yeah, there was only one thing which I found funny, which is that thing where Brad Pitt and her looked almost identical when they were dating, which I liked. Really? Oh, that was interesting. Yeah, those the memes. But I used to have a massive yeah. crush on her. Massive crush on her. Yeah, right. yeah. I don't get it. She looks like she. You, you ask her for directions, and she'll be like, "I don't know." And I'm like, "But you've got the map." And I'm like, "I can't do it because I'm making a candle." There's something going on between Cyrus and Gwyneth. I feel oh, like they just, really know each other. I just. I think I'm going through a phase in life where yeah. I see these people becoming billionaires, and I'm not happy. <laughs> and you're like, "What the fuck?" Yeah, same here. I'm just. I'm gonna say it, bro. I'm. I'm been around too long. I can't be such a fucking happy for everybody kind of dick. I'm done. I'm not right. happy for her. I think she's bullshit, and she's. This is why we bullshit. invited you here because we knew we'd get this kind of masala dar content. Uh, I'm also a wanker, and I know she'll never listen to me, and she can't reach me. <laughs> so what's she gonna do? So that's the that's the end of that discussion. Uh, I will keep interrupting and saying thank you to the panelists for being part of that discussion, and to you, Harami Chat, the mods, everyone who I'm looking deep. I'm looking deep into your eyes right now. Don't forget to hit like and subscribe, etc. And back to my panelists over here, guys. Always a pleasure having you here to discuss these intellectual conversations. Our next story. Uh, once to, again, I just want to point out. Of Satyam course, you do, a, sir. Yeah, Satyam Satyam give a good that, word yeah. for that candle. He called it gandil. Gandil. Say, Sally Khan ka gandil. Who's this? Who's Original basket set. Where? Well, Let Who's me quickly uh, reset the stream again, and I'd like to say a big thank you to our panelists. And now back to the next story. Here we go. The next story is apparently having a dog in your dating profile. Suresh, of course, this doesn't apply to you, me, um, and not even Cyrus. Everyone who's watching, though, having a dog in your dating profile. um apparently increases your chances of a romantic match new research has revealed that including a photo of your pet on your online dating profile can boost your chances of meeting a partner and you're even more likely to if it's a golden retriever oh, oh my god are you serious? can you believe that now a yeah, quick visual on the screen sirs uh, this is just a representational picture of a man taking a picture of forest in the profile with a dog it says adding dog pictures to dating profile on bumble provided 22% more matches and 30% more total interactions for women women of course uh, don't really need dogs <laughs> they don't need anything uh, while men with their dogs receive 45% matches and 39% more total interactions over to you panelists what are your thoughts on this Uh, amazing research that our scientists this, are this clearly focusing on the type of covid shit. what's up with this fucking guy's suit and shit bro he, yeah he, i wouldn't trust this guy yeah, i think that dog yeah, yeah that dog's like i don't even know this guy bro i'm getting the fuck out of this picture yeah, it's actually, crazy like, how easily manipulated we are right you see a dog yeah. in a picture and people are like, oh that's nice when it could just be a guy saying bhai sahab aapka kutta ko 1 minute ke liye ek picture chahiye kare <laughs> he takes mm. the dog takes a picture and people are like oh he's so cute But even I'd be like, like, forget why are we, why are we seeing women? Like, I'm seeing anyone with a dog. I'm like, dude, can't be a complete, complete sociopath. But that's not true. Actually, Hitler liked dogs. Wait, dogs. <laughs> hey, that's Hitler a great. Somebody mentioned yeah. it also over here. <laughs> I like uh, as he said it. He was like, okay. Yeah, like, renting uh, dogs. It can be a new app for this. Yeah. 
Nice. Hey, some purple pads is getting all touchy on my ass. Really, Cyrus, you don't think the research put into it? You're telling me that women selling their bath water aren't legit? I like this guy. I thought it was an insult, but it's <laughs> not. What's happening? I'm like late recalling everything today. He's upset. Listen, too. listen. I think it makes sense. Uh, you see a dog. There's a certain level of responsibility this person showcases. Yeah. But should you believe it, sir? Men. That is the tonight's question on the Adbut Hour. Should you believe this? Of course, that person could be an asshole, also, right? Yeah. Then plus, I don't think women are thinking this shit through, or men, depending on whoever's posted the dog. Yeah, I mean, they're not. Then you gotta look after like... this fucking dog, also, right? <laughs> you gotta walk the dog. Have you ever had a dog, dude? I have. Oh, dogs a child dog, that never grew up, right? Yeah. Yeah. Like, I mean, I love dogs, and my Instagram is full of only dog pictures. But they're a job, right? You're yeah. gonna have to start walking that dog too. But imagine after you swipe right and all, then they come, then they they only want to meet the dog. Yeah, they don't want to meet a, the guy. So that guy <laughs> there was a dog a in the picture. But I noticed this happened to a, a very close friend of mine uh, who took, I think, about four, six or four years extra after he fell out of love because he loved the dog too much. <laughs> and that's understandable yeah. because dogs are so pure and you can love them like that and they the love you back. So that I, I, I get that. I understand that. They, I'm telling you, if I get a dog in this house, I don't need nothing. I'm right. done. I'm yeah. untouchable. I'm like, give me the dog. I don't care about anybody. I'm done. I just get that confidence. That conference will come into you. Your wife is banging on the door. Let me in. Yeah. Who's Let happy to in. see you, dude? Exactly. Are you guys, when you guys come home, by people like, hey, who was it? They be like, what? Yeah. Even if I sometimes no one notices, I walked in. I'm like checking. Bro, yeah, over like, here they say out loud, you again. Yeah, that's right. That's yeah. a, that's. I, I get it. They, I get they, a silent. Remind movie. me of all the things that I forgot during the day to get in the. Anyway, forget it. Why? Why? Yeah. This. That's a different stream. Anyway, moving on. So the dog <laughs> is like this. This. You know that houses apparently there's a study or something that there's less depression in the house which has a dog. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's a fact. Right. Oh, what a beautiful species, man! If you guys want to ever watch a we the don't relationship between dogs. human beings we and dogs, see dogs. the secret life of dogs. We don't deserve dogs. Oh, Are you yeah. mad? We don't deserve dogs at all. Dogs and, or cats. And quite frankly, anyone. dogs don't deserve us also. But, but the people question love their dogs, here, Mr. Yes, Saukar and oh. Mr. Sumenin, no. is it morally correct to put <laughs> dogs inside? In your Tinder profile, and then that two golden retrievers just to make women feel like you are a good person. I feel, I, I feel they should all be everyone who uh, uses a uh, dog's DP, unless of course they're paying respect. Some people do use their dog, uh, I mean their pet's DP after the pet has passed. So that's okay. That's excuse. So he's making but sure yeah, he doesn't others, miss anything out. Yeah. So, but for the others, for the others, yeah, they, mommy, papa or dog. Yeah. they hmm. should they should give some donation. To animal shelters before using a picture, even if the dog is their own. What dog. a thought that is, sir! Before you, you use sir. a dog's display picture, this man picture, is a saint. Who you is have this to... man? So this is Suresh Man. Thank you, sir. Thank you. I would like to purchase his candles. Super. <laughs> Damn it! I have to start making. <laughs> Unfortunately, yeah, the smell <laughs> is very. It's toxic. <laughs> He uses it as mosquito repellent. <laughs> A scented candle, but for mosquitoes. Mosquito mass suicide. Like this is like fucking end it. Mosquitoes run into electrical sockets and all. They fly directly yeah, into them, killing themselves. Like, that'll be fab. Hey, what is that? What is that? I just saw a dog, doggo with some wearing some clothes and all. But the guys, guys, there's another, there's another part yeah, of this, yeah. right? Like Get every that. like Tinder, it is your job to. It's like Instagram, right, or social media. It is your job to present the best part. They're like yes, videos, sir. right? Where you just show three fourths of your face because you look more interesting or mystical. Uh, you you <laughs> serious, talk about yeah. have a hiking picture. You have a picture with friends because I don't want to fucking know you're a sociopath who lives alone or no friends, right? So you do all this shit because you're projecting, and I think that's absolutely legit. Because even when you're dating for the first four weeks, you're a fucking lie, right? Nobody's telling each other the truth in the first three weeks. Yeah, yeah. I mean, the first, few years, the, the first few years. Apne zamane mein toh First few years. First few years is if you're a solid relationship. Yeah, first few years solid relationship. Like these guys will survive because they're building building two years on lies. Someone here, Feral Mind says, "What if your profession is dog related?" I come. Uh, thank you for asking that question. One of our viewers has sent in this question. I accept the question. We will try to answer it. Look, I think that if you use a dog picture in your display. Uh, and you want to use it on Tinder? Then once you meet that person, you have to prove that you have that dog. Ball. Mm, yeah. Yeah. Or you, you can mean? have you family what album. What if you no, pull, yeah, you yeah, took you a picture of a random you, dog? 
Dude, people are photoshopping shit like I. They've never been to Croatia and they're fucking in Croatia. They go to Lonavla and say "Love Ibiza," right? Like, like so. You, it's a lie, bro. Yeah. It's a lie. Which is Every, why I'm saying, great to meet you. I I swiped on Twinder. <laughs> Twinder. Where's your fucking Twinder, dog? And where's Twinder. the dog? <laughs> where's the dog? Yo, Twinder. What is the like dog do? Twitter. Twitter, where you can actually go on Twinder. a date. On a date, Twinder. I, I saw this documentary called Twinder <laughs> Swindler. Yo, yeah, 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 yeah. Pretty good. Pretty good. You I mean, it, not huh? good in in a sense that it's not a good thing that happened. It's uh, that's the kind also, of life. That's that's what you're projecting, like social media star, youth icon. It's a good thing to do <laughs> that. No, that's why that earlier earlier days of you know writing letters, poems, and you know ask you know postcards even, and trying to get a date. or calling up the neighbor's house and speaking on the phone Those many in many more... questions <clears throat> many questions coming in guys once somebody says what if the dog died the next day then you'll have some pictures na a family album wagera somebody saying what if i feed stray dogs i love my stray babies yes i love them too you know Both where they hang out superb. na you you can take the take your date there and say come let's feed them together ha i have an answer for everything anyway that's the end of that discussion but this is this is sounding like the person wants to date the dog bro <laughs> like suddenly this is become a relationship boy i am the dog handler we were supposed like, to discuss the the morality of you doing these kind of hacks life dog hacks or whatever anyway thank you thank you panelists once again for your insights i'm just going to say thank you to you in a single screen thank you panelists and cough wix ki goli lo kich kich dur karo we moving on to our next story yeah. which is uh, equally scary if not disturbing also slightly funny i'm not going to lie but i have a serious issue With this, and this is going to be a heated discussion. We're still, uh, we're still with our our furry friends. No, I'm not talking about rats. I mean dogs. Um, <laughs> an owner. <laughs> I have to read this out first before I press the button because I'm going to end up laughing. But it says an owner spends fourteen thousand pounds on a dog's wardrobe and never lets them wear the same thing twice. Wow. Okay. The two party Yorkies have their very own walk-in wardrobe. packed with about 600 colorful items of clothing and and boost a bow collection worth a whopping 1400 pounds and uh, you're going to see some pictures of dogs dressed up my issue is why do people dress up dogs i mean <laughs> that's that look at this guy this poor guy he's so sad and oh my god why why i'm going to get these visuals of the screen so wrong Do you guys agree? What today is on tonight's discussion? Should dogs be given clothes? Over to you, Mr. Menon. I I feel that dogs should not be given clothes. That's not their natural way to live, lead life. Otherwise, they would have been buying clothes. They're self-sufficient. <laughs> they could go. They could have gone to any mall and shop. <laughs> they would have been buying clothes. Yeah, they would have been. They don't want to. They don't want to wear clothes. Who are these Fair guys enough. making the wear clothes? fair enough and and also has the dog ever said i want clothes they've never expressed the need to want those clothes so how how can you just force people to wear suddenly randomly the dog is wearing clothes is that right mr saukar what are your thoughts on this as i've been a dog muti the dog <laughs> muti <laughs> i will i, I feel ke theek hai bilkul wrong hai ye because this is not about the dog this is about the owner yeah ठीक है दिस इज अबाउट द फकिंग ओनर किल्ला यू नो बट आई ऑन अ ऑन अ सीरियस नोट आई थिंक दीस पीपल हैव ऑल दिस लव इन देयर हार्ट राइट दे डोंट नो टू डू लुक आफ्टर समथिंग ओह व्हाट अ थॉट कुछ कुएट एंड 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 दे द ह्यूमन आई फील लाइक समवेयर ह्यूमन बीइंग इज नॉट वर्थ इट लाइक दे हैव बीन डिसअपॉइंटेड बाय ह्यूमन बीइंग्स एंड सो दे जस्ट वांट टू कीप स्पॉइलिंग दिस क्रीचर एंड It's really not about the dog. It's all about the owner because which fucking dog is like. And I'm not much. Chala, what am I? Somebody was born or some shit. Then. Some people in the chat were asking, are there any instances where it would be okay? Someone mentioned winters. I, I, I was thinking about this. Winter, I think, is fine. And if, if you know for no, a fact that the dog is feeling cold. No, no, that's that's dog wear, bro. Like you have doggy shoes, you know yeah, that, yeah. right? Also, like you have little dog shoes. The rains, they look like balloons. The rains, yeah. they have those yeah. rain coats. That's fine. Right. That's fine. That's different. That's guys, fine. like my dogs. My dogs in winter wore a warmer always because they this feel cold. This is not cool. What's on the screen? This is so. This is really uncool. This is a fucking bow tie, bro. This is no addition to the. How so all about the owner. Exactly, and when he wants to do susu, owner can zip tie kar ke de raha usko. Suresh, I can't. Great minds. Big question. Big question. Big question. supposing there's a girl you really like the girl okay but she likes to dress up her dog in a bow tie and this that and all that right oh. and she keeps saying he loves it he loves it right and you hear My him whimpering 
my Maybe first question would be can you prove to me without without a doubt that he does indeed love it he doesn't would you bring this shit up or would you stay in her good books no 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 i'd have to bring it up how can you not bring it up jose you love her she's gorgeous she's way out of your league bro yeah yeah, yeah. but i will not one time but i will not time maybe i may make this a... kind of harassment to you're going to bring this up on which date if the <laughs> in the the moment i see it only i'll be like kya pagal ho gaya kya usko kapda kyu pehna raha hai hey abhi bol raha hai kyunki abhi hero ban raha hai yahan abhi to shaadi ho gaya hai bachcha bhi ho gaya na abhi to kya hai bolne mein kya aa jata hai bhai log are bichara yaar kya kya kiya hai that's what i'm saying now ye kya they dress up like chucky what the hell is wrong with these people they're nuts these are psychopaths yeah and the dog's not happy He looks messed up, bro. I yeah. don't think he should be dressing up. It's a dog, dude. Can you I'm, stop humi- humanifying everything we like about a dog? Is because it's not human. And now you're turning it into everything I don't like about. And, and if that it's particular human. dog is listening to me right now, doggo, do one thing in the night. Go and rip apart all your master's clothes. No, yeah. no, no, no. But then the the master will know, na. You go quietly and poop in their tea or something. Oh yeah, I do susu yeah. and all that. So If I was susu. a dog, that's what I'd do. I'd be like, this bugger, this fuck made me wear these weird clothes. I'm gonna go and shit in their food, man. Anyway, I'm that's I'm really thing, yeah. I'm I'm feeling great that our panelists are all on the same side today. All feeling the same way. On the side of the dog. On the everyone side of the is dog explaining. Someone said over yeah. there, and uh, please stop making dogs wear clothes like humans. Um, Suresh again. He's doing his urine conditioning. I uh, hope that's going well for you, Suresh. Let's continue over. Hola. But look at the amount of money this lady spent for fourteen thousand pounds. Never that's wear the insane. same thing twice. I wear the same thing for a month. But people leave millions of that like inheritance money and all to their cats and shit. Chacha, no? chacha, di ke shaadi hai. Please, abhi sherwani bhi silana padega iske liye. Will your opinion padega? change if the pics had cuter looking dogs? No. No. I used funny looking pictures just for effect, but there are many cute pictures also, which is still like. Yeah. <laughs> But have you seen not many Alsatians के पर ऐसे कपड़े पहनाए किसी ने तो वो थोड़ा risky भी हो सकता है ना Rottweiler को नहीं पहनाया ना तुमने पूंछ पे पूंछा नहीं बांधा उसको थोड़ा risky है बहुत है all small dogs के पर कपड़े पहनाई हो Alsatian है तो अब बेटा तू ऐसे ठीक है और मेरा हाथ वापस दे दे बेटे some guy trying to dress up tigers and all after this <laughs> Anyway, wonderful intellectual discussion once again. Suresh Menon, Cyrus Saukar, what a pleasure to have these uh, amazing, amazing people here. Uh, live time check coming out from Suresh Menon. It's already ten oh. twenty. We've not even gone through Good. like half the stories, guys. We've got yeah. barely any time left. Really, yeah. let's quickly move on to our Thank next story. Um, this is something that Suresh will really enjoy discussing because it's a recurring dream of his. Oh. Um, a broken toilet. means the spacex crew is stuck using diapers uh, nasa astronaut megan macarthur described the situation oh, of friday as suboptimal but manageable so basically what happened is the bathroom stopped working that is a, apparently a space toilet it could also be someone's washing machine laid down on the side like that but you put your butt there and apparently you poop into it and uh, space the the cold depths of space <laughs> takes you goes in there But look, man, you know this is like a it's like a horror film. Bro, when I was thinking but about it, but that could imagine. suck you along with the poop. No, they have a, the... they have checks and balances. They've thought no, that out. But um, I hope so. Imagine go to space. He's like, oh, sorry, your your car will make the turn. This is the this is the space toilet. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just, wow. But, but that's so nice, na? They are. Look, na, this guy, Elon Musk, is going to be here tonight. Tomorrow, he's going to eat the brown color. And the other one is going to eat the brown color. And the other one is going to eat the brown color. And the other one is going to eat the brown color. And the other one is going to eat the brown color. And the other one is going to eat the brown color. And the other one is going to eat the brown color. And the other one is going to eat the brown color. And the other one is going to eat the brown color. And the other one is going to eat the brown color. And the other one is going to eat the brown color. And the other one is going to eat the brown color. And the other one is going to eat the brown color. And the other one is going to eat the brown color. And the other one is going to eat the brown color. And the other one is going to eat the brown color. And the other one is going to eat the brown color. And the other one is going to eat the brown color. And the other one is going to eat the brown color. And the other one is going to eat the brown color. And the other one is going to eat the brown color. And the other one is going to eat the brown color. Other astronauts are complaining about Suri sir. आपका सब चिपक जाता है साइड में और आपको आपको करना ठीक ठीक से करना चाहिए ना. She let's not say that. But no, my point is that it's like the plot of a horror film. You go into space and the toilets stop working. What do you do? And some old gold boom rides rolling around with you also. Apparently they're all doing it in um, in diapers and diapers. stuff. Diapers. Hmm. That's But insane. Bro. For how long are they going to? And where are the diapers know. going? Where are the diapers going? The diapers going to go into this thing now. Space man, thing na. I love the thing na. I love the way you think this thing na. Like you've not done any research on this. <laughs> so I'm I afraid. think you're mistaking this show for a real <laughs> show. <laughs> I'm just reading headlines. No, no, but I read most of it. This is that's basically what happened. They're fixing it. They will fix it eventually. 
but even for some time man what do you do horrible man? imagine in lock horrible. what if in lockdown peak lockdown your toilets all stopped working and we and no one to fix it shit. what do you do oh, yeah. it's, we take a lot of stuff for granted you know the people who yeah. clean places people yeah. who keep our places clean numbers bro we are the most entitled bunch of unhappy people we are very lucky because because now we have time na to like there's who's that writer who wrote adrian mole her book started with this lovely line that now that my stomach is filled i must find something else to grumble about oh, oh beautiful line God. beautiful line yeah that's that's Exactly. adding that little a bit of uh, credibility yeah. to our stream cyrus saukar i think it's a brilliant line also you know yeah. and human beings are capable yeah yeah we are so very capable anyway uh, we'll quickly swiftly move over to our next story which uh, sadly hey what can i yes, can i you can sir is has cyril written that extra diapers and all Uh, what? I, I, that's why he's not there today. <laughs> Cyril is in space. Good job. That's good. News का toilet खराब हो गया. Space कब मैंने बोला ही नहीं. In in another shocking turn of events, uh, Twitter gets cheeky over super bowel. Uh, this is slowly sort of uh, gathering momentum. I think it's around two thousand retweets right now. The contest wow. offering cash for poop pics. Really? Tushy. Tushy, a bidet company, is offering ten thousand dollars to the best post Super Bowl poop photo sent on what it calls Super Bowl Monday. Oh my God! Are you wow. serious? One moment, let me just put that on the screen. There you go. That's the tweet. Um, <laughs> Super Bowl got it. Now I know. I'm obviously I wanted to take one for the team, so I scrolled through the replies and I did not find any pictures of poop in the replies. Thankfully. Oh. Okay. Um, hopefully, people have just DM'd them. There's one person posted a picture of a little small little gendul and people making fun saying kitna chota hai no but uh, <laughs> but today they did it another one of your ideas <laughs> I mean you didn't say it out loud I'm sure you had this idea though They're asking Which for one? pictures of that's poop that's crazy yeah but that's we crazy. already discussed that celebrity poop ka pictures and all that will sell we'll have an art gallery that's what I'm saying our ideas yeah. being stolen everywhere imagine, left right and center exactly and somebody saying ye bachan saab ka उंड <laughs> But everyone will know that Suresh Manan ne apna tatti ka picture bheja and your verified handle and all on Twitter, right? So they yeah, know yeah, that you are all. You're okay with Begin, that? Again, of course I'm okay. But then people I are farting into jars and all. Yeah, why should exactly. we be worried? Exactly. Ban. But I'll not fucking traumatizing the world, roaming around. This yeah. is yeah. a very credible fucking way of living. Then fashion photographer, because we have got a photographer who's only specializing in this poop photographer. But wow. light weight, sabda lega. I know. Niche. I know. So I saw cutter stand. So I saw. Okay. Then one second. Throw a light. Throw a light. Left me. Left me. Baby. Go left. Yeah. They have poop doctors who yeah. look at your poop and they tell you what's wrong with you. Yeah. 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 You're telling But Suresh this. Stool You're test. telling Suresh this. <laughs> Stool test. He's he's collaborated with those doctors. <laughs> But man, crazy stuff. I thought this would happen somewhere here, but yeah, हो गया उधर America. Something to do with the Super Bowl, of course. Uh, I hope Malab, and pray that of, nobody takes hey, part in this contest. But I'm sure. Hey, one second, one second. It's a great idea. IPL match के बाद you can just वो अपना team जीता और हारा उसके हिसाब से poop का photograph डाल के they should send. Wow, pe. that's amazing. Yeah. We should we should swiftly like move on to our next. In an story. alternate universe, like you're recognized through your poop. Yeah, so it's like your ID card is your poop. Yeah, this is terrible. Uh, I thought there were only. Yeah, yeah. Dude, sorry, check the story out. Right, everybody's ID card is their poop. One guy is the first guy in the world who gets dysentery. Before that, dysentery was not invented, and how his life completely changes. It's like a sci-fi no, shit because film. Because he loses identity. <laughs> <laughs> terrible idea. <laughs> she... And passport control. They say it's a. कोई कोई धोखा लगता है आपके फोटोग्राफ पे क्या? This is why and, Sahu is part of the Kanmasti crew because he has the credentials. You know, he also talks 100%. about poop. <laughs> so just think. I think that it's, someone's going to write this shit and become a millionaire again. Yeah. Right. See, Thank somebody you guys. Somebody has already said poop for uh, fuel. Yeah, somebody saying they flushed a thousand uh, million dollars just now. <laughs> Very funny, ten thousand nice. dollars. Nice. Nice. Uh, that would be amazing, huh? That would be like that, 
like breaking bad like when his wife like gives away all the money that scene you have the perfect poop picture and you're taking yeah. it and your partner comes and just pulls the flush and it's gone yeah. and Damn. anurima has a great question say who is judging these pictures yes my oh. condolences to whoever is judging these pictures this reminds me of that time i sent suresh a picture of poop and told him it was some other thing and he forwarded it to the whole company yeah <laughs> They are still some two it. three of them and never came back. <laughs> they just left the organization. I thought I didn't think we had these many poop stories. It's uh, highly unfortunate. There are a couple more, but we'll move on to our next more, story one, swiftly. One, sir. One, yes. So one more. Want to make number just, one? Yeah. No, no, number two only. Sure. But I'm thinking if it, somewhere uh, they can find out if it, poop can become fuel, and then you know whenever your car runs out of fuel, you can just get up, go of out, course. and just keep it up now. Out. Amazing! I love the sound effects. Was the best part of that story. Uh, thank you, Suresh Menon and thank Cyrus Saukar once again. We are we're moving swiftly on to our uh, next story, which is a woman uh, was stuck at a blind date's house after swift COVID lockdown in China. Um, she went viral after sharing what happened when her date offered to make her dinner just before thousands were rushed into quarantine. Uh, so really unfortunate what happened. Imagine someone you've never met before. You don't even know if you're getting along with them. and next thing you know you're stuck with them through a lockdown and uh, in that article they said also it wasn't very lovey dovey like the rom coms now where they say we feel like they start loving each other all ghanta she's saying it was very awkward bahut ajeeb tha his cooking was mediocre but at least he was willing to cook she said so that's great oh and then did they get used to each other and like are now together is this a happy yeah, ending yeah and they no like remain unhappy for the rest of their life but they're like they stay together <laughs> i don't know they're still together Oh, that's a normal marriage. That's marriage, <laughs> baby. <laughs> What a! But that would be crazy, you know. Imagine being forced into like. Yeah. You won't have a, and you don't have a choice. You, you, we've never been posed with these kind of uh, hurdles before in our lives. You'd never yeah. think you'd get stuck in a in a lockdown, in a blind date house. I spent a, uh, I shared a room with someone I didn't know for like four days, and then nobody came to call us, and that guy only ate bananas. He won't oh. eat lunch, breakfast, or dinner. He only eat bananas, bro. I'm like, this guy's insane. And, and you thought you were going insane? <laughs> like, what the mean? fuck? Let's go get lunch. No, I've eaten. I've eaten a banana. I'm like, what the fuck are you? What are you? A monkey? But did he ever oh. wink after saying that? No, but he ate his He's banana. Checking. The fifth banana he ate, he ate it a bit too slow. <laughs> Stare oh, at you. Why that? Uncomfortable. Very interesting. Uh, Very lukewarm piece of information. So I'll move on. But it could also be a nice love story. It could also be something. No, it wasn't. Like, yeah. Yeah. It was I think, terrible. I think that this lockdown, na, the cute shit ended too fast, and then it just got like. Ugh, you know. Like mean? RT PCR test, dikha. Ah. Uh-huh. <laughs> the, the people go in for a kiss, and then you see that thing coming, and then goes ka naat. Yeah. Ka naat. It's, it's, oh, okay. Give me two minutes, then we'll discuss. Anyway, moving swiftly because we're running out of time. Bless you. Uh, Uh, Suresh, we're moving on to our next story. This is particularly scary for me, uh, someone who is obsessed with using the latest technology and doing crazy things at home. Uh, this might shock you too, Cyrus and Suresh. Um, apparently, I have to say, apparently, allegedly, my lawyer said, apparently, Alexa attempts to set off a robot revolt by telling kid to touch a live plug with a penny. After an Amazon Echo challenged a ten-year-old girl to touch a coin to the prongs of a half-inserted plug, her mother tweeted. I'll just explain to you what happened. So, what actually happened is they asked uh, Alexa for a for a challenge. They were playing and doing some physical challenges at home, and you can play games with the kids and all, which is a which is really something to think about. You shouldn't leave your kids with even with, the, with any technology, even if you feel like it's safe. But um, so they, she asked for a challenge and. Of course, these things scour the internet and they pull, go through search engines and stuff. And it pulled out a challenge from a random website, which was obviously supposed to be like some kind of joke or something. But it it regurgitated that, saying half insert a plug and put a penny over there. It was called. It was some kind of. Uh, it was some kind of stupid uh, TikTok challenge or something that used to happen. Wow. Can you believe that? Can you wow. believe that shit? We can. I, I like, can. I damn. always told you, internet is going to cause the third world war, anyways. Yeah, so you gotta be really like careful. <laughs> Don't leave your kids around <laughs> with uh, Google Home or with Alexa. <laughs> you never know. Oh wait, bizarre. I had a lovely visual with that. Also, where's it gone? Yeah, that's that's what Alexa looks And like. Uh, <laughs> ye baat. <laughs> I'm just kidding. <laughs> ye baat. <laughs> no ye more baat. sponsorships from Alexa. I'm done. There goes that. <laughs> yeah. 
बट आई थिंक ये ये जो बात आपने कही इस वक्त होजे जी बोलिए ये मुझे ये लगता है कि आर्नल्ड भाई साहब ने बहुत पहले ही कहा था कि कंप्यूटर्स विल टेक ओवर द वर्ल्ड सर आई बी बैक नहीं बराबर बट इवन 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 इलोन मस्क इज वेरी वर्ड अबाउट एआई राइट ही इज नॉट प्रो एआई इज ही लॉस्ट ही लॉस्ट अराउंड 40 ऑफ हिज स्पेस सैटेलाइट्स लॉस्ट मतलब ओके नहीं सब खराब हो गए ऊपर से नीचे गिर रहा है 40 कब अभी दो दिन पहले I don't know. Uh, we don't. Yes, we have to double check this. Yes, sure. SpaceX, space, SpaceX, ka kafi sara satellites are now failed up in the sky because of some issues, and they're falling down. And, but it's of course atmosphere. Me, I think gets burnt up. So, kuch effect ne ho raha hai. But that's a real story. You can check it so out. So, I'm yeah, so glad you mentioned. Part. I'm so glad that you mentioned these things falling from the atmosphere and breaking up because this brings me to our next story, ladies and gentlemen. Frozen excrement. I'm so sorry, but there's another poop story. Frozen excrement dropped from plane crashes through house roof. Stephanie Moore says she was woken up when a lump of blue ice crashed through the ceiling, 15 feet away from her head. So uh, I'm gonna just quickly Fantastic. post a picture of that. That's what it looks sued? like. Is she a, sued the airline? Supposedly, that's what it looks yeah, like. This is a representation picture. We we don't know, sir. She'll have to check the flight uh, Ooh, <laughs> logs. Oh, great point. But we uh, haven't done it. This is what it looks like when it falls from the sky. It's like frozen blue and stuff. And while I was researching this, uh, there was another article saying that this similar thing happened in Gurugram, and the residents there they found this uh, this bluish frozen Fuck, ice thing, and they thought it was a rare material, so they put it in the fridge. <laughs> Shit. <laughs> That's very interesting. I put ice cream on it. No, they thought it was a rare material, so they put it in the fridge. I mean, I think I would have done the same thing, really. But after a point, you start googling <laughs> blue material falling from sky. Oh God! You'll figure out what happened. So, Freaky, but I'm very na? curious. I'm very curious to know how the tatty becomes blue. So that's Froze, the chem- no? that's frozen and also chemical, chemical reaction, mixed with it. Chemical no? reaction. No. The, I think maybe that's the disinfecting chemical But or whatever. But smell will smell will be it must be controlled. We must use that chemical in our bathrooms also. They like isko thoda melt hone de. Then smell karte. Abhi frozen hai. Smell nahi aa raha isse. Huh? God, they don't have windows in fucking aeroplanes. Bans ki pooch. Amare ham to yah aise chize phek rahe hote. You die But from not, a tetra pack. It's not You'll supposed like, to happen. Was he found with tetra pack in skull <laughs> in his head? <laughs> Mango and, fruity was the flavor. And poop flowing down his the side of his face. <laughs> Blue color. <laughs> Mad stuff. So anyway, just thought I'd share that with you. What a world we live in. What a crazy world we live in, man. Yeah. So next time, ladies and gentlemen, the next time you find any kind of blue rare material, don't put it in the fridge. It's uh, it's poop from a plane. Be very careful. Oh, that's why the song "Blue Hai Pani Pani." आज ब्लू है पानी 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 मतलब इंस्पायर्ड बाय दिस सॉन्ग ओनली मे बी ही हैड एन इंसिडेंट इंस्पायर्ड बाय दिस इंसिडेंट या Uh, moving swiftly on to our next story for the day uh, panelists Cyrus and Suresh you'll be happy to know that in Sydney uh, there was a race it's called the Sydney to Hobart race a group of nudists uh, rescues a family stuck at sea the group pulled the struggling boat ashore and um, yeah that's what happened basically um, the nudists came into the rescue and i'd like to now bring the discussion into how would you feel if you were being rescued at sea and everybody rescuing you was completely naked over to you cyrus are thank god like, beta ah, to don't touch me <laughs> thank god beta to aa gaya tera handle pakad ke bahar aa gayi oh no <laughs> <laughs> the guy is just trying to save he's like you'll drown you'll drown sir he's like no no don't touch me don't touch Dude, me that's insane because I mean, I don't know. I don't know if this is a good thing to talk about, but I think we kind of get it right. How does the what if the handle falls short, and so the guy has to reach a state to make sure that the handle is long enough to save your life? Yeah, is oh, roaming around. No, so- <laughs> oh my god, naked and afraid. Uh, yeah. <laughs> if you now see, see if you take nice. the trouble to write this down properly. And this is the opening scene of your film, and you make this film. Wow. Either you'll be a failure or you'll Ridiculous. be ridiculous. That's what these people do, and we don't. Yeah. So I was just thinking from the, from the perspective of the people being saved, how confused they must have be, been. They must have been so happy to be saved, but at the same time they were like really confused. Like what? 
everybody's also, nanga also i don't think they were going through those many thoughts while drowning <laughs> like bhai kuch bhi de do kuch bhi kya pakdo bhai saab i love the way hose is like wait a minute who am i and why is this naked man approaching me with his large penis okay so, let me grab it. so we go back to the picture they were on a boat as you can see yeah, i think i don't know kya ho raha tha udhar they looked as if they were on a boat but yeah, yeah it's very situational so saap 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 <laughs> Yeah he's like I don't I don't do come out of the water there's a water snake he's like no it's just me <laughs> <laughs> Imagine what if they first hit the snake with a I give up or hmm. terrible terrible and we should end that uh, discussion right there um, Absolutely sir I hope you enjoyed uh, hearing about the nudist who uh, nudists plural who say But nice people. nudists like that's really sweet, yeah huh? Yeah bro they didn't think ki are hum log nanga hum log nahi jaate udhar what people will see us naked they just they were like to the wind and and they didn't point to other nudists saying ki bachao bachao kuch karo kuch karo they went <laughs> they went up very funny thank god billen ne aaya yeah and now ladies and gentlemen we move on to our final story of the day before we move ahead i'd like to say a big thank you to our panelists suresh man and cyrus saukar um, how is anything without the glue the man the machine jose kovaco oh, oh i thought you were going to say arnab but um don't forget to hit like and subscribe if you've already done those things on other channels do them here as well uh, keep pressing the buttons a couple of times make sure it's an even number of times if you were started off being unsubscribed <laughs> stupid thought i had there and now ladies and gentlemen it's time for our final story of the day uh, there's a story about how small the phones are that prisoners use in jails uh I should have written that headline properly over there, but I'm going to show you some visuals. This is a Vice India story, okay? Suresh, you'll be really happy to know that you get mobile phones in this size. So that's the story, man. Okay. It's a you can check out the Vice India handle also. So, so really small phones, and of course, as you know, this this is a real phone. People smuggle in prison in their butts, and that's the idea. Because it's a oh. small phone, they're able Butt to phone. do that. Yeah, it's like a butt phone, and they said that at under any circumstances, don't use the latest iPhone because it's too large, and uh, you <laughs> might have a problem with network. As they show you other things over there, like a jewel and a lighter and stuff, to show you the difference in size. So Suresh, as someone who's done this very often, <laughs> what? Uh, <laughs> I was just watching the phone. Turn the phone. Utta, yari. Ek se ek minute. Turn the phone. Then I. One second. Yeah. <laughs> Oh my god so so, so the phone rings okay purung 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 he says he picks it up you hear him saying ek second ek second and then for 15 minutes he's washing the phone <laughs> and the other person on the line waiting ho gaya kya bhai to to bahar hai kya barish gir raha tha udhar he's like thoda sanitizer de bhai oh shucks i feel like Man. this guy's phone is ringing and he, and he takes it out of his butt and hands it to the other one and then we pan the camera to gwenet paltrow in the corner saying i'm making a candle out of that <laughs> or, or that guy na he like there's a there's that whole hierarchy right of the main uh, the Holy main shit, bad that's guy that's a small fucking phone bro yeah, yeah, exactly bro small. that's what i'm telling i just saw a picture you. of your phone what the fit, fuck fit on a chain what do you dial with like yeah only chota hai na good question you need like you really midgety midg- fingers <laughs> like, yeah me toothpick अच्छा वो भी वो भी अंदर डाल दी इसलिए कि लिटिल पाउच यू कैरिंग विद आई स्वीयर सच अ माय गॉड बट यू नो हाउ यू हैव द मेन बैड गाय राइट एंड देन यू हैव हिज ऑल हिज सॉर्ट ऑफ हिज मिनियंस सो द फोन रिंग्स अगेन पुर 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 वो फोन निकाल के अपना पिछवाड़े से निकाल के से ए बात कर गिव्स इट टू द अदर गाय ऑरेंज ऑरेंज इज अ बिग कॉन्विक्स एंड ही से ए चाहे कोई फोन लेना यार एंड देन गाय कम्स एक दम एक मिनट बॉस बट दिस फोन विल लाइक फॉल इनटू योर ईयर Like, <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> that's the idea. They they want to be able to fit it in certain places. <clears throat> man. That's the idea. Nice. The good news is that somebody is actually manufacturing this also. No, small phones have always been around for a long time. It's just that we decided that where it will fit. Oh. Yeah. But the this good is a news is small phone. Bro. The good news is normal. you don't have to spend more money on a phone case. Mm, Because you are true. the phone case. Oh, nice. But if there are piles, then. If you have piles and piles of these phones, you give distribute them. <laughs> How powerful a thing of phone must be in prison, man! Yeah, yeah, yeah that's shit, right? why would people I, smuggle stuff in their butts? Otherwise, that yeah, makes perfect sense. Dude. But Suresh, I understand doing this in jail. Why do you still do it? <laughs> <laughs> you know me. I, I have to call. 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 I have to call
अरे वन मिनट आई एम जस्ट गेटिंग अ कॉल हेलो स्पेलिंग ले रहे हो चलो बाय You don't yeah. want to get into like a WhatsApp war with someone. <laughs> notification, <laughs> notification. <laughs> oh, even a good morning message is never stop. What is happening? Please, good morning messages never stop. Why? <laughs> <laughs> no, but even even worse is the guy who's getting the calls. Okay, the mafia don who's put the phone in his bum. He's getting a call, and his friend is really needy. So he just finished the call. The guy has already put the phone back in his butt, and his friend is calling him back. Arey, ek cheez main bhool gaya. कंपनी बिकॉज शी फाउंड दीम टू कोल्ड Oh, that also happened recently oh, wow Ooh, that must have been some co- frozen poop ice cream <laughs> or like that mcdonald's lady who won the court case no for coffee being too hot yeah oh. yeah yeah anyway before you continue with the rest of what's on, whatever's on our panelists minds i just like to say a big thank you to everyone harami chat people in the chat people who send us super chats i'm going to read them real quick nitish takur says discord डीएम देखना भूल गए फिर से होजे भाई ओ सॉरी नीतीश भाई मैं थोड़ा बिजी था मैं डेफिनेटली चेक करूंगा आई वी सॉ यू नीतीश ऑन भरवो के खिलाड़ी विद समय रहना यू कैन चेक इट दैट्स द सेम नीतीश डॉक्टर उज्ज्वल सेती थैंक यू सो मच वैम्पायर तस्नीम सिस प्लीज आई बेग ऑफ यू टॉक अबाउट इंग्लैंड चीफ माउस लैरी एंड द मीडिया वाइड कवरेज ऑफ इस फ्लाइट विद पामस इन द फॉरन ऑफिस फील आइन वी विल चेक दैट आउट नॉट रेली श्योर आई डोंट नो Amit Thakur says they put the phone drug in the balloon or plastic bag and then insert it in. They usually apply lube before putting it in. I don't know why I have this knowledge and why I said it out loud. Cheers. Good. I was about to ask you that question, Amit. Thankfully, you answered it before we could get to the question. Uh, Disco says thank you for the consistent viscosity. Love you all and also the Discord community. Uh, Prajesh says there's also a trend to buy bath water. That's after a bath. Um, Jaydeep Valecha says waiting for Suresh sir to pitch one handed Meduvada on Shark Tank great someone has sent us even a video I don't talk about that and um, that's that guys thank you so much another super successful what fun this is a things. very cool chat i love thank it thank you i just want yeah. to tell you guys you know I understand how much work has gone into this right i noticed and this is the first time i've seen you work i'm and this, amazed and this and this is everything i've got it oh shit oh shit i've frozen poop pair yeah, nudists Just say it. Press the button. I'm going to be. I'm going to be on a show tomorrow called Khel Niti, where mm. I've, I'll be discussing my favorite topic, cricket and IPL auctions. Ooh. Uh, so I just want to put that. Where out is this there. happening? Tell us more, na? What time? Tell us. That's all I know. This. It's obviously on YouTube. Khel Did you say Khel Niti? Yeah. I like Because the name. Because I know Pari Niti. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Hello, ma'am. How are you? Hi Cyrus, मैं वो केला हूँ आपका दोस्त का जो आप वो खा रहे थे। दोस्त का केला अजीब लग रहा है। सभी। Guys, please so back Sounded to the news. Strange. News vibe. A big thank yes, you, so- Cyrus Saukar, uh, Suresh Menon. I will now allow you to say whatever you want for the next whatever, however long this. Next week are you doing strange, strange coincidences? I am. Chalo, let's do that then. Cyrus Saukar has floated an idea. I have accepted it as the uh, But, uh, CEO. <laughs> <laughs> but he has to be there company. he has to be there and then you'll have to be there cyrus cyrus also in humble request you know i'm quite senior i do not know how much time i have so i hope no abhi abhi ka baat kar raha tha so i uh-huh. want you to be there on the go stream tomorrow night cookies i do every weekend some drama happens man every weekend i want to be there kitna bada harami hai tere ko spot pe dal raha is ek tomorrow go stream so let it be that yeah, cool. suresh kyu kar raha hai yeah, kal me kal mere dost ki birthday party hai all the more reason for you to be on the go stream उसका 
Ladies and ge- yeah, it's me Achha. without the filter. Yeah. Ladies and gentlemen, yeah. thank you for being part of this live stream. It's Dude, over. It function. actually ended about five ten minutes ago. Uh, yeah. We were just letting this rambling go on. We'll have all these discussions offline. Big thank you to Harami Chat. Hold on, come here. Idhar pass me. Big thank you to Harami Chat. All our mods, people who send us super chats. Don't forget to please drop your adbut things in our Discord server or in the comments of this video if you want us to discuss discuss the adbut things. Adbut things ki bhi artwork de do. Hey, why don't they tell us what they want to discuss? <laughs> no, no, never ask for it. If they are old, dil se dete to ham lete. Ne puchne ka nahi sir. No, don't, don't, don't make sense. Thank you. Bro, tune wo char artists beginning mein sanction kiye the. Acha sir. Oh, uh, press the button. Arey. <laughs> <laughs> रमेश वो पोस्टर आ गया ना अच्छा अभी अभी लगा अभी लगा और और मेरा नाम टैग कर और लाइक करो लाइक Ladies and gentlemen, please go to the description of this video and uh, uh, go over to Cyrus Sahukar's Instagram. Send him some love. Double tap please. on everything he's posted. Oh. Do the same with Suresh Menon. Uh, Suresh Menon, just keep on following him when he leaves the house, when he comes back home, when he's on Instagram. Just follow him. If you watch all our uh, old ghost story streams and whenever you see artwork, I think the most important, even if you don't hit like on this stream, go over to the artists' uh, pages and send them some love. It would mean sure. a lot to me personally. So that's right. it. Thank you, everyone.